today is my baby shower and I should have been vlogging before I got myself ready and everything but anyways if this is your first time watching a video of mine welcome to my channel today we are going to be celebrating me and my fiance's little girl that is coming well she's coming in November that's when she's due but she better be here in October so right now the baby shower started at 2 but it's 2 43 as you know we're on CPT and APT and APT is African people time so that's why nothing has started so far but um I hope y'all enjoy this video I'm not sure how much of a vlog it's gonna be it might just be um it just might be um, me showing y'all scenes of what's going on, but hope y'all enjoy it and I'll see y'all later. Adios. Good morning, y'all. Happy Wednesday. Today is. I should probably know the date, but it's August 24th, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, it is. Okay, so today is the day Kendall and I are going to the courthouse to get married. Um, my mom's here. She's going to be one of our witnesses. And then um, one of Kendall's frat brothers are also going to be our witness. So we filled out the marriage certificate last night. I didn't realize it was that easy. We're just going to go to go pick it up. And then we're also going to go and get... Um, married a civil ceremony as of right now um it's crazy life is just moving so so fast i never would have thought that i i mean obviously i thought i would get married but this is just crazy okay so today i'm wearing this dress baby em and i are supporting this dress um i did have a white dress but i wore it to my baby shower instead and speaking of my baby shower let me just tell y'all I took my camera with me, got ready to record. I might even insert the clip so y'all can see that I was even trying to record. But obviously when you are the guest of honor at somewhere, it's really hard for you to record and do other things. You really gotta be on the ball. So I commend YouTubers that have parties and do all that stuff and are able to record. It was just so busy and I actually lost my camera. My mom just told me last night that she had it in her purse. Can you believe that? But um yeah, so that's what's going on. We're about to go get married and I will see y'all there. Hopefully I can record. I don't know what the situation is going to be like, but see y'all later. If there's a question of my heart You got it don't belong to anyone but you hey if that's a question of my love you got it baby don't worry i got hey y'all happy sunday so i'm so behind in youtube stuff let me just tell you what's been going on in my life so um Week 28, I really didn't have too much going on. All I did was work that week, and then we went home for my baby shower. And believe it or not, I attempted to start vlogging at my baby shower, and I got so caught up in my own baby shower. I don't know. I commend YouTubers that host their own party or or are they're the guest of honor and they're able to keep up with their camera i actually lost my camera y'all i could not find my camera to save my life but luckily my mom had it she found it outside at the baby shower but whatever so i wasn't able to record at my baby shower but kendall's friend did record portions of it and some pictures are coming so stay tuned for that um and then kendall and i got married on wednesday so it's been crazy. I really haven't been recording. My mom was here for a week, but everything started to slow down now. Today, I am 30 weeks. I'm probably just going to upload this as a quick little vlog because I know some people are like, where you been? Y'all, I promise I'm here and everything. But um, I just wanted to give y'all some updates on us and everything. So like I said, we did get married on Wednesday. It's an awesome feeling. I'm married to the man of my dreams. I'm super, super happy. I'm about to get too much into that before I start crying on camera. But um, my mom was here for a week, thank God. She helped me out a lot with Baby M stuff. We still have a lot to do. I was actually just telling Kendall today, I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed because 
We have 10 weeks of my due date, which she could come before or she could come after. We don't have her crib, her changing table. We still have a few things missing and it's a, I'm a little bit overwhelmed because I just want to have this stuff done. I told myself by 35 weeks, I want to have all of her stuff completed. And then I start working on my stuff as far as like um, buying nursing bras and preparing for my labor and delivery bag. Because, you know, you got to be prepared before you go. So, yeah, so I just wanted to show y'all a few things that we have and what well, we got at the baby shower. I couldn't record a, what I got in my baby shower video because most of it was closed and we would have been watching that video all day. But just want to show y'all what, what I got and I will check, check back with y'all later. See ya. Okay, so we're just going to start in the room. I actually went and purchased her crib mattress on monday got it for 30 dollars. i got it on offer up it's in the plastic it's never been used before so i think i got a really good deal because everywhere else we've been looking it's like 150 dollars. my aunt actually got her her bedding set this was on our registry so i'm super happy about that kendall and i well kendall and his friend actually put together baby m's dresser it looks a mess right now don't judge but we have all of her clothes in here this is mainly zero to three months newborn and three to six months clothing in here it's a lot y'all it smells so good because we use drift um more clothes more hats and stuff like that i did show some of this on snapchat as well look at these little frilly panties <laughs> some socks clothes if you could guess and then her blankets uh my grandma made some and my aunt made some so we have a couple of blankets in here this is her car seat we decided to just bring it in here and it was purchased from our registry so it's so cute i'm so happy we have it our detergent stock so my mom actually went out and got some detergent so i or i should say a lot we actually left a lot back in maryland but she's pretty much stocked up for a couple of months if not a year okay so this is the outside storage so she got um her pack and play we're just going to keep this out here in the storage until we set this up a couple weeks before she comes clearly we don't need this out right now this is her car seat, oh not her car seat, her stroller. We clearly do not need this right now, but we'll put it in the car eventually. And then this is her high chair. This is gonna be in storage for a couple of months because clearly she doesn't need it until she starts to sit. But we got re we received all of this stuff at our baby shower and we're just super grateful. So just a little bit off just a little bit off topic because I know we I was showing you baby shower stuff but say goodbye to our couch y'all remember our couch that we got for $30 off or offer up my mom actually bought us um, as a wedding set I mean as a wedding gift she went and bought us a new sectional so so thankful and grateful for my mom um, we're getting rid of this tonight and then our sectional will be here tomorrow. Excuse the mess, but I just wanted to show y'all the overview of our closet right now. Um, my mom, I'm just so grateful for her because she washed every one of baby M's items in here, but we still need to reorganize the closet. Like for example, these bags need to be thrown away and then I can move my stuff over here. It just needs to be put together how I want to put it together because this is not going to work. But anyways, let me show y'all. Ignore my weave. <laughs> I got the four moms um, infant tub. I was really excited about that. So that's one thing we got for the baby shower. Most of these little dresses, not all of them, most of them were my dresses when I were when I was a little girl. So like this, for example, my mom kept this. Luckily for her, I am having a girl because what if I ended up having all boys? But she kept this for baby M and I can't wait till she fits them. I just think that is so cute. My mom got her majority of her Sunday best item, but she got a lot of dresses, a lot of clothes and everything. Like, do y'all see most of this? Like, if I really would have wasted, not wasted my time, but put most of this on uh, what I got for my baby shower video, we really would have been sitting here for years. But how cute is this little outfit, okay? Fake little monkey outfit. <laughs> but yeah, um, as y'all can see, 
really need to organize all of this and it's a little bit overwhelming because it's just a lot of stuff and there was a lot of stuff that was also left in Maryland as well so like over here this is her wipe stockpile we still have about I want to say like 1200 wipes left in Maryland and I still have another baby shower to go so she is very very blessed she got a lot of this um there's still some more clothes in here that's not been folded. I mean, just piles and piles and piles of clothes, y'all. Um, let me show y'all this. Got a boppy, which I'm super, super excited about. Kendall's aunt got that for us. And then just diapers, more diapers. And then we also left about 1,200, if not 1,400 diapers at home in Maryland. So... Just going to give y'all an overview of what baby M got and I will see y'all in my next video.